Welcome to a very special Saturday night edition of Locked In with me, Tom Allen, and of course, Linda. Linda, who's still waiting for the scars of her plastic surgery to heal. Oh, no. You're looking great on it, Linda. Really good. I've been sent a lot of tips from all around the UK on how to best cope with the Smackdown. And I got a plethora of offers, a plethora of offers from both Liverpool and Wakefield. So I thought I'd have a look at who is delivering what, and maybe who comes out on top. Shall we begin? Let's. Peter from Liverpool here. I've been uh, learning how to be a dentist in isolation. Um, why have you, why have you messaged? If you can't grow a cactus in Yorkshire, then you can always knit one. But it's not the same, is it? Why would you knit one? Why are you on your own in that room? I'm worried about you. My top tip for surviving the lockdown is tattooing my makeup on so I look good every day. Did you do her own tattooing? With her own makeup on her face? During the smackdown? My top tip for surviving isolation is don't cut your own hair. Yours seems to have been, has that, has that just been growing since lockdown? I mean, my goodness. This is what I made earlier. Steak, gin pie, can't wait. I'm a bit worried what else you might be making pies out of now. The creme de menthe? Ooh. My top tip for quarantine is tequila. Love, lovely, you can barely see your face. You looked a bit like Gail Platt, actually, as well, if you don't mind my saying. Not an insult. My tip for isolation is plenty of wine, plenty of exercise, and a few ciggies. If that's what, if that's what she needs, get, get her that. Good for you. I've been making jellies and decorated them with my favourite celebrities. This week's celebrity is you. What I found really upsetting about that was that it looked like a, a, a bowl of blood. However, I really enjoyed it. I thought it was very resourceful. Well done, Wakefield. Thank you so much to Liverpool as well. What?